So here's what I've been working on for the last week and a half. My new gun cabinets. I started with these uh, 1970s or 80s high school lockers and peeled that crappy paper uh, metal off the side and replaced it with heavy galvanized steel all riveted in. I rebuilt the bottom all the way around. You see those bolts and welding with uh, square tubing steel so it has a nice solid base because they came made it of this paper. I uh, steel on both sides welded a frame piece of metal big heavy steel and covered it in fiberglass on the top to make it all solid. That's what it started out looking like. I'm gonna paint this. I just wanted to show that's what the lockers came as. And I made them a little bit more secure too, strengthened them up, a little bit of extra steel. Every one is a little bit different. This one here is my gold cage. I put in new shelving, all steel, all bolted in the side with structural steel and welded together. Carpeted all the way around, so here's some tall things, some books, keys, socks, whatever, whether it's supplies or tools. The locks work. Here I put separate shelving, three levels, probably for boxes of ammunition, cleaning supplies, things like that. I uh, also painted the inside of all the doors. These new bolts are here because I took these cups out. They are super bright red now and uh, got the crit of the corrosion and made them work better so that everything opens and closes nicely. Down here in the bottom, I have split into one-third and two-thirds for some slightly larger storage. That one's forest green on the side, some paint that I had around. And uh, rebuilt the bottom. This one's bright blue. Now this guy here, the main door, I uh, welded the main catch shut because it wasn't secure enough. Added heavy hasps here. Latched at the bottom and a nice big metal handle which I welded up myself. Carpeted the inside, that's the existing shelf. Carpeted all the way around. And just for a little bit of extra strength I added another shelf at the bottom to raise up the levels of the guns a bit. Assuming that's what I'm going to use it for. So they'll sit here and then here I'll put like a brick of wood or plastic formed or something, fiberglass maybe, and carpet it with grooves for the barrels so that you can lean. I guess in this space you could probably comfortably do six, but I don't have like that much, so. <laughs> Anyways, it was a fair amount of work. I had some help, but did all my own welding, and it's basically my first welding project with my uh, welding machine that I got. Nice little MIG. Use a lot of really, really cool products. It is worth paying good money for Tremclad Professional paint. It is awesome. This can goes way further than you'd think. I probably spent between the glue, always using PL Premium construction adhesive, polyurethanes, and the carpeting, which was uh, three sheets of it from Costco. Probably spent about $200, $220 refurbishing this thing. And the lockers I got for 50 bucks, but you could probably pick them up for free if you wanted somewhere and hunted for them. Anyways, I'm pretty proud. Finally ready to get it in the house.